Yeah, so I recently had the, my uh, ice water from the distributor in the in the freezer door. Uh, started tasting funny, and just wanted to go through uh, what this is. Um, I have a reverse osmosis system hooked up, and uh, that's actually hooked up to the ice maker as well. I show a couple um, videos on that in different videos. You see, like this one's been put in ice up on the top, and then on the very back, a lot of ice started freezing up. Um, you know, and it might seem like it's the water. I actually noticed that if uh, just using just water without ice tastes fine, but the uh, water mixed with the ice, uh, it's the ice that absorbs a lot of stuff from inside the freezer or inside the fridge. You can put leftovers away or whatever. Anyway, it started absorbing that taste into the ice and that was mixing with the water. Nice easy fix of just emptying it out once in a while, you know, starting fresh with new ice. And uh, but this one actually froze solid uh, to the back and had to kind of break some of that stuff free in order to be able to take the whole bin out. And uh, so that's the process here. And I was trying to make the, the armature turn in the hopes that that would free up some of that frozen stuff that's right on the end of the armature that was preventing me from being able to pull the bin out. Long story short, it's just dumping the ice and starting fresh with new ice, but this one was a little bit more complicated in getting it out. Dump all this ice, that's what's uh, smelling so bad. Tasting bad, not so much smelling bad. That's waste and it'll just dump it on the grass and then clean this whole thing out. All that rinsed out, cleaned out. All right, yeah, clean up the freezer, but anyway that'll it's not the water that smells bad, it's the ice that actually, it's not the water that tastes bad, it's the ice that winds up absorbing uh, smells and odors from the freezer, and that'll make your water taste bad, so that's what's happening here. So, just have to clear it out once in a while, no biggie. Moral of the story is uh, if your waters in, from the dis ice water start tasting bad, it's probably time to uh, change out the ice and start fresh. And on a side note, if you're hooking up a new ice maker, you want to dump the ice for like the first 48 hours to make sure that everything in the line is clear. That can also not be a healthy situation for a new ice maker hookup. Now I have fresh ice and the water will taste good again.